Hello everyone. Recently, a news broke the internet that scientists found phosphine in the atmosphere of Venus, which is considered to be a big sign of life. Why is a toxic gas like phosphine is considered to be a big sign of life in other planets? Watch the video till the end to get the answer and if you are new here, subscribe to our channel to watch videos of straight facts without any unnecessary illustration. So, what exactly is phosphine? Phosphine is a pyramid-shaped molecule with a phosphorus atom on the top and three hydrogen atoms in the base. It is very toxic and quite rare on Earth. Then how is it even a sign of life while being rare on a planet full of life? To be considered a sign of life, a molecule at least has to be somehow associated with life. Although phosphine is toxic for life that uses oxygen, it is not toxic at all for life that doesn't use oxygen. Even on Earth which is full of oxygen, anaerobic life lives in swamps, marshlands and in the intestines of most animals. Anaerobics are those who don't use oxygen metabolism. They produce a lot of phosphine. And yet, scientists found no other way that could produce a big amount of phosphine in a planet like Venus without the intervention of anoxic life. Whenever scientists find a habitable place outside Earth, they search for some molecules that are associated with life. Phosphine is one of them. And phosphine is not only associated with life, it also cannot be produced without anaerobic life. So, it is actually a big sign of life. But does only having phosphine in the atmosphere confirm that Venus has life? Well, Venus is a very unhabitable planet with a temperature of 464 degrees Celsius on the surface and clouds of sulfuric acid in the atmosphere. But who knows? Life might have found some way to escape the extreme environment of Venus. But the chances are very low. It is possible that there was life a long time ago when the environment wasn't that extreme. The only way to know this is to explore. In the future, several space programs will be launched to explore Venus and thus we will be able to know the truth.